everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well and keeping safe. The UK has just gone into a second lockdown, so I hope everyone in the UK is keeping safe as well. Feel slightly better about this lockdown, don't know about anyone else, but I've only cried twice, which is progression on the last lockdown. Um, but anyway, yeah, hope you're all doing well. If you can't really tell by the title of the video, today I'm coming back at you with another Shein haul. Um, I did one of these about a month ago on my channel and it went down really well um, and people really enjoyed it. Um, and she and her very kindly offered to work with me again. So before we get started, this has all been gifted to me by Shein. I was able to pick out some of their stuff from their autumn winter range. We are working it together on a Black Friday collaboration. Um, so from the, let me get it up so I can, so I get it correct. From the 16th of November to the 26th of November is their Black Friday sale. And then from the 26th, of November to the 30th of November is their Cyber Monday sale. So basically, all throughout that week, they'll or those weeks, they'll be having discounts. Um, but I also have a discount code for you as well, which I will leave on the screen somewhere. But it is SUA55, which will get you an extra 15% off the entire site um, from the 5th to the 5th of November to the 6th of December, um, and that is 15% like additional extra to their Black Friday discounts and Cyber Monday discounts. Um, I hope I've explained that well, but basically use my discount code and you're going to get 15% off more, 15 more percent off. Um, I could have made that more complicated if I tried. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to dive straight into it because as you can see, I have a huge box sat behind me. Um, and I think that's all I want to say. I'm aware that my hair looks very crazy right now. I left it in plaits last night. I also have no fake tan on, so if I'm looking a bit pale and a bit ill, that is why. So, without further ado, gonna jump straight into the video. Before we get started, as always, if you are subscribed, please do make sure you subscribe. Subscribe? Please do make sure you are subscribed. Um, I'm gonna be trying to upload twice a week now because I have a bit more extra time on my hands because of lockdown. Um, obviously, I'm still going to university, so it doesn't really affect me that much. Why am I bad? I can't be moving. Um, so yeah, it doesn't really affect me that much. However, I do have a little bit of extra time where I'm going to try and film. So. That being said, also follow me over on Instagram, which I'll leave on the screen now, um, where you can find like daily outfit inspiration and you can see how I style these outfits a bit better um, and I look a bit more put together over on my Instagram than what I do on my YouTube channel. Um, but yeah, without further ado, we're going to jump straight in because I have a huge box um, and I'll be here all day if I don't get started. Um, this is a try on haul by the way, so I'll probably talk about the items more in the try on clips than I do when I'm showing them to you. So yes, let's get started. So as you can see there was a huge box behind me, I'm just going to dive right in and pick out from the top and see what I get. So before we get started I have had a little sneak peek because I just got so excited and yesterday uh, I had a bit of a meltdown whilst on my Zoom lecture. If that doesn't sum up university in 2020 I don't know what does. Um, and the parcel man knocked at my flat door and had a big parcel and I thought this will cheer me up, going to have a look through it. So I did that. Um, so it is a complete surprise, I have had a brief look. Um, but yeah, just gonna dive straight on in. I opened this yesterday. Oh my god, it is the softest thing I've ever felt in my entire life. It's just this plain white cardigan, but I cannot tell you how soft it is. Like I have never owned anything so soft. And I wish I could like pass it through the camera to you because it's so soft um, and snuggly. It's kind of like, you know the fleecy blankets that you get from Primark? The one that I'm currently in my bed now. Um, kind of like that soft. But not that material it's literally just polyester don't know how they've done it because i've been looking for a material like this for myself to work with because i do a fashion degree cannot find anywhere and she and have pulled it out of the bag um i of course will leave all of the prices and the links to everything down below because i can't quite remember the exact prices of everything but yeah item number one is just this really nice and soft like i cannot explain to you how soft it is i've never owned anything so soft um, cardigan which I'm sure I'll be getting a lot of wear out of and once I have it on I'm never gonna want to take it off uh, which probably isn't great oh my god guys I literally cannot tell you how freaking soft this is it's so cozy and snuggly I'm literally obsessed um so yeah just it's quite cropped I didn't think it was gonna be so cropped but I'm not mad about it I think it looks quite cute um just to like chuck on with jeans but I'm here for how soft it is like I never want to take it off. If it was like a little bit longer, then I could like tuck it into jeans or a skirt or whatever. But I'm not mad, it's not. I really like it, really nice and soft, and I will definitely be getting a lot of wear out of this. I wish you could like feel it through the camera because it's just so soft and I'm fully obsessed with it. If there is just one thing that you buy from this haul, let it be this cardigan because 
I'm not joking when I say it will probably change your life and you'll never want to get out of it again. Item number two. Believe it or not, I don't have a lot of bags, which I feel like may come as a surprise because I feel like every girl has loads of bags. I have my Karl Lagerfeld bag, which is like my child. Um, I literally use it all the time. It's my pride and joy. Uh, so I thought I would get a new bag that I can, you know, just take out, which isn't as expensive because uh, my Karl Lagerfeld bag was embarrassingly expensive um, and I feel like I should just use it for special occasions and at the moment I don't so I wanted to get like a cheaper bag which I could use like day to day so I just got this cream it's like cream and grey coloured bag it's kind of giving me the um, is it Chloe or Dior? I think it might be the Dior bag obviously it's not um, but it's kind of giving me those sorts of vibes it comes with it two straps inside or like a long thin strap and then a shorter thick strap as well um, but yeah um, croc material as well not like croc the shoe but it's in like a crocodile pattern um but yeah just pick this up the bottom half is leather and the gray is actually like a suede fake suede material um but yeah really like this again it was really affordable and great if you just wanted like an extra bag which is what i wanted because like i say i have my car lager filled which i use all the time and i just wanted like when i'm going out day to day a new bag which is this so we all know my obsession with coats and jackets. I did a coat haul a couple of weeks ago on my channel, which went again, which went down quite well as well. Um, and in that, I said this is a judgment-free zone because I own a lot of coats, uh, and clearly that left my head when I was picking bits from the Shein website because I ordered another three. Um, I have a problem, <laughs> uh, but yeah. The first jacket which I ordered, it, yeah. To be fair, it's not a coat; it's a jacket. Actually, to be more precise, it's a jacket. Uh, and we know how I feel about shacket, it's got a bit of a love affair with them at the moment. But it's just this beautiful beige and cream shacket. Um, it's really hard to like show and it probably looks really like <laughs> unflattering on the camera. Um, but yeah, it's just, I don't know what sort of material this is. You would think me being a textiles degree, doing a textiles degree, I don't know. It's kind of like woven, I would say. Um, and it's also got like a shimmer running through it as well, which is really nice. And it kind of gave me Christmas vibes weirdly much be because it's a bit sparkly um but yeah i can't wait to style this with like a pair of chunky boots in the winter um it's not overly thick so you would need to like layer up underneath it uh however you know i'm always in chunky knits and whatever so i'm not too fussed about, about that um but yeah just a nice jacket to add to my collection so here i just have it on the jacket it's a really really lovely color you can kind of see it's got like a shimmer running through it well i don't actually know if you can see but there is a shimmer running through it um, but yeah, it's a really nice fit. It fits perfectly and it actually fits on the arms, which doesn't normally happen. I normally have to like roll things up. Maybe I just have really short arms. Um, but yeah, fits perfectly overall. I really like it. And yeah, the one thing it doesn't have though is pockets, which I really hate because I always have my hands in my pockets. Um, however, I'm sure I can look past that because apart from that, it's brilliant. I really love it. And I can't wait to wear it. Like I say, not that thick, like you will have to layer up underneath it. The next item that I've picked up, is okay so this i'm thinking this this is just a really plain basic black dress so it's just a bodycon straight all the way down it's got like a tiny slit on the right side i think uh yeah basically just a black dress with a square neck bone kind of um and i just picked this up because i actually didn't own like a plain black dress so i thought i'd pick this up um just i know no one's going out at the moment because of lockdown but i thought you know when lockdown ends just a nice classic little black dress that I can wear for dinner or drinks um, when I'm allowed to again. Uh, so yeah, also this has adjustable straps which I love um, because I don't have a lot in the chest area and when things don't have adjustable straps they tend to not fit me um, and I can't really work around it unless I like take them up myself so I'm glad that this has adjustable straps. So here is the little black dress and I fully love this. It fits like a glove, like it fits so perfectly. Um, and there's still like a little bit of like room in it so if I had dinner I'd be fine it's perfectly um yeah not much to say about it just a basic black dress with like a little square neckline and it's got a slit here try not to flash you um but yeah very much like this and I feel like it could be dressed up really nicely and um, as well as dressed down if I just chucked on some like tights and a big teddy bear coat I would be good to go just track of I've already lost track of how many items you've gone through um so maybe this is number six I'm not quite sure but I picked up this lovely black and white, um, what's the word, blouse. 
uh, yes this lovely black and white blouse it's kind of got like a balloon sleeve thing going on it's tighter at the cuffs quite a thin material so you may need to like layer up underneath it it's also got quite a steep v-neck which I'm a little bit worried about but to be fair if I just put like a nice lacy um bralette or top on underneath I reckon it would be fine um but yes again really soft material which I'm surprised by because Shein is one of those really affordable websites and kind of like most online retailers you never really know what you're going to get until you actually get it um but so far I'm really impressed and everything is like really good quality and really good material so this is just super soft kind of like a sheery type of material uh, just black and white leopard print i love a good leopard print item oh okay i know what this is i got so excited when i was ordering this so i love me a bit of hound's tooth uh, i also love me a coat as we have established at this point in the video um so i got myself a hound's tooth coat which i'm very excited for so it's just this long line i reckon it'll become like down to just below my knee um coat which I love. Um, I'm very excited to wear and style this. I thought this with a little black dress and a pair of like black heels would be brilliant for like going out uh, when Bojo allows me again. Um, and yeah, just a plain black coat. It has got a raw hem at the um, end and on like the collar. Don't know how I feel about the raw hem on the sleeves though. So I may have to try and work around that and see if I can see what it looks like rolled up or whatever. But apart from that, really like it um oh and i forgot to mention every, all of this is in like the smallest size so either a six or a size small um just in case you wanted like reference for size that's what i picked up uh, and yeah really love this it's actually quite a thick material so you won't need to layer up as much underneath as you would with like the jacket that i picked up um but yeah i am obsessed with this coat i love it it looks fucking sick it's great um again wouldn't necessarily, I maybe just fell over. Again, wouldn't necessarily wear it with this outfit. I just had this on and it was easy to like put over the top. Um, but yeah, I love it. It's so cool. I really can't wait to wear this and style this. I actually don't mind the sleeves too much. I wasn't sure how I feel about the hem. Um, but I really like it. It's not got as much like what's the word? Space in it as the other two jackets, but I'm not overly gussed about that because it's slightly thicker. Um, and yeah, it comes to like just below my knee. I think this could really dress up an outfit, like if you have a really basic outfit, chuck this on and you're good to go. Um, but yeah, very impressed with this. It's also a really nice material, which we love. Um, so yeah, I feel like I talk so fast in these hauls and I just need to chill. And it's because I get really excited about talking about clothes, which is probably really sad. Um, but I need to like remember to breathe <laughs> because I get halfway through and I'm like out of breath from talking so quick. Oh my goodness, I know what this is. Okay. I'm so excited about this. Now, I love me a loungewear set, and especially going into lockdown round two, I've literally been living in loungewear. I've got my trackies on right now, which I basically haven't taken off since I started university, because it's all online. Anyway, that's not the point. I wanted some more loungewear. So I got some more loungewear, and it's this Teddy material shorts and top set, and I'm fully obsessed. Like, I cannot tell you how soft this is. Oh my God, imagine. Imagine this set with this cardigan on the top. What a dream. I think I've just died and gone to heaven because that would be so soft and so snugly. I'm so excited. Um, but yeah, this is just like a really nice fleecy teddy bear material, kind of like a blankety type material. Um, and I'm just so excited to wear these. Obviously, you won't be wearing them out, but you bet I'm going to be walking around my little flat in this little cold thing. It's like a dressing gown, but fashion. I'm so excited to wear that on the cardigan. I'm going to be in my element. She in, you have done well, and I'm so excited to wear all of this. I literally cannot tell you how soft this is, much like the cardigan. This is so freaking soft. So this is the first loungewear set. Um, I'm obsessed, literally love it, and I never want to take it off, um, but it's so super soft. You can just see that it's like a little cropped top and some shorts, like this. I'm so excited that I now have like a teddy bear fleece um, covered because I've actually got teddy bear fleece bedding, and I just think, if I sleep in this, in my teddy bear bedding, perfect i'm so sorry about the sirens i live on a main road and they're just constantly going past um but yeah very excited to lounge around in this i really really like it fits perfectly simple and basic but cute and snuggly which we love now the final jacket i promise <laughs> um, that i picked up is a denim jacket now you might be thinking hannah don't you own a denim jacket like you own so many you must have one uh, yes yes i do i own two 
blue denim jackets and one yellow denim jacket but I don't own a black one so I picked up a black one <laughs> um, it's just this black cropped denim jacket now I'll tell you what actually my cousin Isabella who might be watching this not quite sure um, when she came around for my birthday in August she was wearing a black denim jacket and she looked great in it and I was like oh I really want one and at the time people were like Hannah you have too many jackets I say people my boyfriend was like you have too many jackets um, so I didn't get one but I picked one up now and I'm very excited to wear it but yeah but I think Belle just wore like an all black outfit with this and it looked great uh, so I picked one up for myself uh, and it's just this cropped black denim jacket it's a little bit distressed a bit like me really um, and yeah I'm really excited to wear this I think it's gonna look so cool it smells a bit weird though you know sometimes when you buy denim and it's got that weird smell this smells a little bit weird um, so I might just give it a wash before I wear it but yeah really love it it's a little bit oversized which I like in a denim jacket and that's the last jacket I promise here is the black denim jacket it's a really nice length it like stops at the perfect length what am I trying to say I have just rolled the sleeves up um, because I wasn't a fan of how it looked when the sleeves weren't rolled up um, and ignore the fact that I've got it with blue jeans I probably wouldn't wear this with blue jeans um, but yeah really like this I'm sure I'll be getting a lot of wear over like autumn winter it's the perfect perfect length as well it stops like just above my hip bones and there's like enough space in here to get on a jumper if I wanted to underneath which we love um so yeah very happy with this and you can kind of see like the distressed detailing on the sides and there as well which is really nice but yeah so the next what's this oh I know what this is so again on the subject of loungewear I feel like I definitely had lockdown in mind when I was doing this order um I just got this really beautiful satin pyjama set. I love me a good pair of satin pyjamas. Um, the shorts look a little bit big. What size is this? It's an extra small. Um, but yeah, it's just got like a little cropped red satin top and little like satin shorts. Do you know what? I love satin pyjamas because when you shave your legs and then you get into like a freshly made bed and have satin pyjamas on, <gasps> best night's sleep of the week, let me tell you. Um, but yeah. Just a really beautiful like burgundy kind of colour. I don't actually know if I'm going to get much wear out of these in the winter because <laughs> not going to lie I wear like the ugliest long sleeved long legged pyjamas because I get so cold but definitely in the summer I'll be wearing these. Um, and yeah actually I thought it would be really cute for Christmas like Christmas morning little red pair of pyjamas not that anyone sees me in my pyjamas apart from me. Um, but you know it's 2020 we we look good for ourselves and no one else so i also picked up another top i say another top i actually don't think i've picked up any tops until now um but i just got this tan colored like crop top um yeah it's got like a little ruched detailing on the like bust area which i really like uh, and it's like a ribbed material it's quite thin so you'll need to like layer up over the top of it if you're gonna wear it in winter um but yeah just basic long sleeved ribbed crop top again I'm not sure how big this is going to be around like the bust area because it looks a little bit oh it might be alright actually it looks okay I really need to remember to not look down in these videos because my double chin comes out uh, someone remind me not to do it in future so here is the tan crop top now it is very cropped it fits perfectly like I really like it however it's very cropped so not ideal for autumn winter but it's cute and I like it um, so yeah you can just see that it's got like ruched detailing at the top um, and yeah I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger on the top but it actually fits perfectly just a plain basic ribbed crop top um, which is really easy to like style and just chuck on with anything just like the ruched detailing I thought we added a little bit extra a little bit of like something extra to the top which was really nice um, and yeah the colour doesn't wash me out as much as I thought it would I mean I don't know how it's like picking up on the camera but I thought it was going to really wash me out however I think it looks alright you know not mad about it very happy I picked this up I feel like I don't own many basic tops like I own a lot of fancy tops I don't own many basic ones so I've now got some more basic ones to add to the collection I feel like I've gone for fairly basic pieces in this haul because I don't want to get anything too uh, out there especially with lockdown round two no one's going to see me in it so and the last clothing item before we move on to shoes is this is it what i think it is yeah this navy sweater 
not a lot to say about it apart from I just really wanted a sweater. I was watching Friends recently and Rachel is always wearing like oversized sweaters and little skirts and I was like oh I could recreate that. It's just this navy sweater and it just says Los Angeles on it and I just thought this would be really cool in the winter either to just chuck on with leggings for like lectures and whatever um, or I could tuck it into like I have a little version of like pop it into a little mini skirt um, and a pair of chunky boots would also be quite cute. Um, but yeah, this isn't overly thick, like it's a fairly thin, thin, fairly thin sweatshirt material. Um, yeah. Here is the sweater and I absolutely love this. I feel like I've said this about everything in this haul. Um, but yeah, I really, really like this. It's really nice and snuggly. It is slightly oversized, so it's a little big, but I like that. Um, and I've just tucked it into my jeans. Probably wouldn't really wear this out. It's probably more of like a chill loungewear kind of vibes but I really like it it's also a really nice colour I don't actually own much in a navy but having said that I actually think it might be quite cool like I said earlier tucked into like a little skirt um, and chunky boots but I really like this again don't really own anything like it so I'm sure this will get a lot of wear over winter because it's very nice and snuggly and you can just see it says like Los Angeles on the front never been to Los Angeles would like to go one day so until then I will wear my Los Angeles jumper it's the last few bits I promise I also picked up this little necklace which I'll pop a close up of because you can't really see it but it's just like a silver chain with like little silver stars on it I don't think it's a choker I'm not quite sure no it's not um but I just wanted another necklace to like pair with this one and this one's like silver and rose gold uh which again I got for my birthday from my brother I think um but I just wanted like another necklace to like layer up underneath it might not wear it all the time but I just thought if it's there it's there I can wear it on its own as well on to shoes I'm so excited about this <laughs> okay so the last two things I picked up two pairs of shoes because it wouldn't be a clothing haul if I didn't pick up shoes much like it wouldn't be a clothing haul if I didn't pick up a jacket or a coat um so I picked up these and I don't own anything like this and they give me like I have my life together vibes I don't um, but yeah, they're just these let's see if I can. little flat, what do you call them, like pumps? They're like nude with a little black pointed tip. Absolutely love these. I just thought if I wear these with like a pair of jeans or like smart trousers, it's like it's giving me like businesswoman, you have your life together, like go get that degree vibes. I mean, I don't, but my shoes say I do, so that's all that matters. Now, one thing I was would say about Shein shoes is size up and um, everything else is true to size however in my last haul I bought size 5 boots and they only just fit so I bought size five and a half shoes this time around and they look like they're gonna fit perfectly should we have a look I mean I would not advise wearing them with trackies but they fit oh they're well nice so I have no idea if I'm gonna leave that clip in because probably wasn't the most flattering angle because so I don't actually own anything like this um, and it's not really a wintry shoe but when when do I ever dress practically? <laughs> I'm all about looking good so that is pair that is pair number one that, that that's the shoes that's the first pair of shoes oh my god it's only half seven in the morning and I literally cannot string a sentence together the final thing in this haul might just be my favourite thing. Mind you, I literally love everything in this haul. Are these? Can we just? Sorry. They're amazing. They are amazing. Um, don't own a pair of leopard print boots. Didn't think I ever would, but I do, and I love them. I think my mum might own a pair of leopard print. Is she? Or am I just making things up? Not quite sure, but I've definitely seen these on someone I know. And I was like, oh, I really like those. Uh, so I picked myself up a pair. I'm obsessed. They're so nice. They're just this suede type material with a heel on it. The heel isn't that big, which I like. Basic leopard print boot. I hope these fit. Let's try them on. They do. Here we go. They're amazing. I love them. Again, wouldn't wear them with trackies, but, um, you know, just envision them with a pair of, like, black jeans, the black denim jacket, and a black little, like, Top underneath an all-black outfit with a pair of pattern boots is a vibe. I'm loving it. Uh, kind of giving me cat stage vibes, but not really mad about it. Again, I sized up half a size in these, uh, and yeah, really like these. Very excited to wear them, and I'm so glad that they fit. Wow, 
feel like I need a nap after filming that. Um, my room literally looks like a bomb has hit. I can't deal. So, that is the end of my Shein haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I have great fun filming these. As you can tell, I get very excited. So I do apologise if I, like, word vomited at the camera for 20 minutes straight. Um, but yeah, I hope you did enjoy that video. If you did, please do give it a big thumbs up. Rem remember, remember from the gonna get the dates right because having me I'll get it wrong remember from the 5th of November to the 6th of December to use my code again I'll leave it on the screen now it's just SUA55 which will get you an extra 15% off all of your orders um, throughout that month and also an additional 15% on Black Friday offers so yes hope you did enjoy this video like I said everything will be linked below with the prices um, and direct links if anything takes your fancy um, yeah I think that's everything that I wanted to say. Um, if you guys want to see how I style these a bit better, please do head on over to my Instagram um, where you can get like a better feel for how I would wear these out. Um, and yeah, hope you have enjoyed the video. Please do give it a big thumbs up. If you aren't already, please do make sure you subscribe. If you have made it this far into the video, thank you very much. Um, and yeah, I will see you all in my next video.